It's very, very important in this month, Breast Cancer Awareness Month, that we do everything in our power in our state uh, to make sure that all women have access to mammograms and cancer uh, treatment and screening uh, in order to prevent bad things from happening. Uh, we know from the statistics that women of color uh, suffer from a much, much greater mortality rate from breast cancer. Uh, oftentimes women who have no funds, who are not insured, uh, have not in the past had access to mammograms and screening. I've signed laws and provided uh, in our budget for breast cancer screening uh, for everyone. We want to make sure everyone is in and no one is left out. This is a mission of a lifetime. We're calling this the Breast Cancer Quality Screening and Treatment Initiative. And this is a unique initiative for three reasons. First of all, it's a joint project between the Illinois Department of Healthcare and Family Services, which runs a Medicaid program for low-income women, and the Illinois Department of Public Health, which runs the Illinois Breast and Cervical Cancer Program for uninsured women. Secondly, this quality board that we are naming today is the first in the nation. What we now know is that research demonstrates that these disparities in breast cancer mortality are often the, a function of disparities in health care, the, the quality of care. What we want to do is, to, with the advice and, and, uh, and support of this quality board, we are going to identify approaches that we ought to be taking to make quality improvements in the level of health care we provide in our breast cancer screening and treatment. And the third reason is that we are also uh, going to launch three pilot projects that we call navigation projects to help women who have been diagnosed with cancer to navigate through the complex system. And we are testing three different approaches to this. One will be an urban approach right here at, at, uh, at Mercy Hospital. We will have a rural approach down in, this, in the southern part of the state. And thirdly, we're going to have a suburban approach for disabled women through our new integrated care program. One out of eight women will develop breast cancer at some point in their lifetime. This is a fact that we see now. It's also the most common cancer among uh, adult women in the United States other than skin cancer. It's the second leading cause of death from cancer among women. The Illinois Cancer Registry projects that 9,320 women in Illinois will be diagnosed with breast cancer in the year 2010 alone. An estimated 1,880 women in Illinois will lose their life to breast cancer this year. But early detection can help. If you find early detection through mammography, which is the best technique available to find it, even before the time period where you start feeling the presence of a nodule or something going on in the breast tissue itself, you can actually transform someone's life and the life of their entire families in our community. You can actually have a 98% survival rate with very early detection. If you, however, wait, you can go down to 26% uh, five-year survival at stage four. That's when the cancer is moved out of the breast and moved into other parts of the body. We must continue to raise the awareness of the importance of early detection and encourage women in our lives to get routine breast cancer screening and exams. So improving breast cancer detection and improving treatment uh, is a mission, and it isn't uh, in a small priority at all. It's a very important priority for all of us. Every single person in Illinois has to dedicate ourselves to this mission. It's our moms, our sisters, our daughters, it's our nieces. It's so important that we not forget uh, and in every way band together for this great mission.